Hey YouTubers, so in this example we are going to embed an image into our part. And I'm actually going to put three in here. Um, next month is Halloween. I'm trying to think of some creative things I might do, maybe make some videos. Um, all the images we have are from uh, pixels.com I believe it is. And they're all copyright free just in case there's any YouTubers out there that have a problem with this video. Um, all right, so let's get started. I've already went ahead and created a um, basically three um, billboards, we'll call them. Really, this is a single part with um, a bunch of extrusions in it. Nothing too incredible. So to do this, we've got to go over to Sketch and start 2D Sketch. And we'll pick this first one to sketch on first. And then lo and behold, you will see image right here. So that's going to ask you where your image is. And we got to find the image. And I think we'll start with this one. So then you'll see it comes in scaled to some ginormous size, unless you um, factored that in ahead of time. Then you got to drag it around, shrink it down some more till it fits. And you may have to scale your part up a bit just to get it to look right on there. Um, we're not going to do that in this video. And obviously, I could have planned this better if I would have thought about the ratio of the pictures. All right, so there's the first one. And that is in there. Looking pretty cool, huh? Let's go ahead and add another one. We're going to do all three of them. All right, so once again, I started 2D Sketch. Click on Image. And which one are we sketching on? We'll, we'll do this one. Just kind of a knockoff from the woman from uh, Suicide Squad. Oh, I somehow got two of these in here. This time I make it small before I drag it up there. All right. So yeah, once you put one image in, it's going to think that you want to add another image for some reason. I do not know why it does that, but um, you just got to be careful of it. Make sure you right click and click OK to get out of it. All right, one more image. This is pretty simple stuff. Eventually, I'll do a, a uh, lesson on how to use some of the geometry of these two um, extrude shapes from um, obviously something like this there's too much going on you had to pick something really simple to do and of course that's going to be in the way lo and behold what a surprise last image that we have done we'll put it right there and right click OK and make sure I get out of there. And drag it up. Then we've got to rotate. Okay. 
So it was a good idea to pick this because it is not so simple. And now that I look back, I should have swapped these photos, but oh well. It is what it is. That's why. Uh... All right. So now we're going to finish sketch. And I will probably take this into uh, HitFilm Pro, um, expand upon it, and do some more things. So do a, a fly through. Um, and basically have the camera fly through through the different images. Something I wanted to experiment with, and um, this gave me a reason to do it. All right, well, thanks for checking out my video. Please like, please subscribe.